So I'm talking to the students about my industry and as a woman in trades in that industry. So I work for Rio Tinto Rowers Division. Uh, STEM skill, skills are really relevant in my industry, uh, especially with the way that mining is moving more into a digital workplace, um, uh, particularly with automation. Uh, and so the E in STEM for engineering is really prevalent in what I do day to day uh, and how we apply our tasks. And uh, we have the application of STEM and then we have um, all the supporting structure around that as well. Technology is going to play a huge part in the next 10 years of my industry. Rio Tinto has already moved significantly forward in that space with our automation of our equipment and, and the applications that we have. We now have autonomous trains and they're without a driver as well. Right? And the reason they're the world's biggest robot is they're, because they're 2.4 kilometres long. Okay? So if you're ever out on our network and you see a train, look at the very front. If it has a blue light on it and the blue light is on at the front of the train, that means there's no driver in there. We will see a lot more use of technology and with that will be the creation of new roles. And we've also got structures to support that with uh, introduction of new training courses in automation uh, that we can apply within the workplace and have people entering our workplace already hold those quals as well. I think one of the biggest pieces of ice I would have given myself if I could go back in time is to say that it's okay, your career journey will take a few twists and turns, but ultimately you will continue on the path that you want to and you'll end up where you want to be. Just because it's not heading in a straight line right then and there doesn't mean you won't get to where you want to get to. The advice that I would give the students is to take any opportunity that's presented to them. They're actually uh, in a pretty privileged position that the companies around here will offer those opportunities and all they need to do is jump and take them with both hands and make the most of them when they're doing it. So if it's work experience or something like today where they have guest speakers come and speak to them, ask questions of those speakers and just try and make the most out of every opportunity. Mm -hmm.